Hey guys, I'll be here for another jump volleyball training tip of the week. I'm here with Ben in the uh, sports center in Vaudreuil, which is really close to Montreal if you were uh, wondering. Now, we're here to talk about uh, diving to the floor, but doing a pancake, okay? A lot of you guys asked us about it. You wanted to know how to do it. Well, we're gonna explain to you how to do it from here. Now, if you want to refer to the video we did on diving, that's gonna help you understand how to actually get to the floor and lower yourself down so that you can get to the floor without hurting yourself. Because a big part of the pancake is actually diving and sliding to the floor and extending your arm to go and get that ball so that the ball bounces on your hand doesn't touch the floor. It bounces on your hand, gets up, and allows one of your teammates to play the ball. Now, Ben's going to get into this position and in a slow-mo, okay, pretend he's going to go to the ground, and he's going to demonst demonstrate one of the mistakes that a lot of players do, and it is this one. So what it, some players do is that they keep their elbows bent so that the ball comes here and bounces here, okay? Now, what does that mean? Well, if I'm a coach and I see you do this, well, it tells me that you could have probably played it as a bump, okay? It's right there. That means you can actually play it as a bump, all right? So why use a pancake when you can actually bump it up, right? So what you want to do is really play that pancake when the ball is far. That's when you want to use that technique, okay? So you want to have your arm extended so that the ball uh, bounces on your hand and then gets up. Sounds good? So we're going to demonstrate now. I'm going to toss the ball from low, okay, just for the demonstration. So it's not going to bounce very high, but once the ball actually comes uh, after it touched uh, a block or it comes from an attack, you're gonna see it bounce much higher. Okay? Ready? Okay, so Ben dives, hand extended, ball bounces on the hand. Like I said, when the ball comes from a little higher, it's gonna bounce higher and your team will be able to play it, okay? So the two things is make sure you lower your center of gravity when you push and slide on the floor and make sure your hand and your arm is uh, extended, okay? So try that in your next practice. Thanks for watching, guys, and make sure to subscribe for, uh, to our channel for more volleyball tips. See you next time. The Sports Center in Vaudreuil is located just west of Montreal, and I want to thank them big time for letting us use their gyms. Their facility is amazing. They have everything you need to live an active and healthy lifestyle. Gyms, courts, climbing wall, and even therapy services. Seriously, make sure to check it out if you're in the area.